Alright guys, welcome to a quick video running through these scheduled tasks. So if we jump through to the scheduled tasks on the game panel and click create new, um, it's pretty straightforward. So we need to name it. So I'm going to name it daily restart. That will be the first example I guess we run through here. Um, one thing that's worth noting is the time zones for all of the tasks are in UTC plus zero. So just Google your time zone to UTC plus zero and you should be able to easily find out what time you want to put in here. So um, for a daily restart, we obviously don't care what day it's on. We want it to happen every day. We don't care what day of the month it's on either. So uh, if you don't know how to use these, by the way, guys, um, you can hold control while you're selecting them to select more than one option or to deselect them. Or you can hold shift and it will select, you know, all of the ones that you have between the one that you've got currently selected and the other one that you select. Um, or what you can do is if you've just selected one, you can just hold control and A and it will just select all of them. So um, that's how you use these radio boxes. Uh, these are on other websites and stuff too. So we don't care what day of the month it's on um, and the hour of the day. So um, we want it to probably happen at like eight in the morning, let's say. So you obviously don't want to just drop the server down without giving people a, war a warning. So um, you can click down here to add another task and you can add as many as you want and you can stack multiple warnings if you want. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna give uh, a five second warning before restarting the server. You'll probably wanna do a five minute warning and a 10 minute warning or whatever. This is a test, um, so I just want it to happen a bit quicker. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, firstly, for the first thing we want to happen is this um, command right here, right? So these are just console commands. So I want the server to say, uh, server restarting in five seconds and then obviously after five seconds i want to send the power action um now with power actions you have restart start stop and kill just like you do on the console so i'm going to send restart um, and this will pretty straightforward every day at eight in the morning it will um give people a little heads up before restarting the server so if we come over to the scheduled tasks now, um, you'll see you've got three buttons here. You've got delete, uh, toggle status, and trigger schedule. So if um, we click on trigger schedule, and then I jump in game here, we'll see a message pop up in chat there. Um, and then after about five seconds, the server will restart. Um, and that seems to be working fine. So it'll tell you when it's next going to run, which is about seven hours from now. Um, and then I'm going to just show one more example, which will be like a weekly restart. So for a weekly restart, um, let's say we want it to happen on Friday before the weekend. Um, we don't care what day of month it's on, obviously. Um, and we probably want it to happen at something like seven again. Um, so I'll select seven. And obviously you can do something like half seven if you care about that. Or if you, you want to, you could have it running multiple times a day, obviously. Um, so you could select, you know, as many of these as you want and have it running, have things running loads, you know, so you can get real creative with this. Um, but let's just go with uh, three in the morning. Um, so let's say that we just want to do restart the server. We don't want to give anyone a warning because we're a, we're a bad owner. Um, we'll just do that. And then obviously here we have our unnamed schedule, um, which will happen six days from now on Friday. If you want to edit a schedule, you can just click on the name here um, and it will take you in to edit it and you can do what you want with it. So the schedule system is super flexible and I hope this gives you a pretty in-depth view of how to use it. Uh, thanks for using Crident Networks and have a nice day.